steel is the backbone of industrialization and as india is one of the most important members of the emerging developing economy demand of steel for infrastructure as well as for real estate automobile engineering goods and consumer durable segment is enormous of the iron and steel sector in india india is not only the second largest steel producer it also stands second in the steel consumption in the world the growth of steel sector in india has been driven by the availability of raw materials like iron ore coal limestone and economic labor in 1954 the hindustan steel limited hsl was formed it comprised of the vilai steel plant the raulkala steel plant durgapur steel plant alloy steel plant and the bokaro steel plant the hindustan steel limited later became the steel authority of india limited the first iron and steel plant was set up at kulti under bengal iron works in 1874 followed by tata iron and steel company limited at jamshedpur established by dorabji tata in 1907 It was followed by large steel plants by Isco, JSW Steel Limited, Rashtriya Ispat Nigam Limited, also known as Vizag Steel, Jindal Steel Plant, and SR Steel, currently AMNS, and many more. Around 50% of steel production in the country comes from SME sectors, either IF or EAF units. India also has a large number of re-rolling units and sponge iron units. Apart from MS Carbon Steel, India also produces alloy steel and stainless steel. Employment opportunity in the iron and steel sector in India. The total employment in the steel industry is more than 2 million that includes both direct and indirect employment. Many auxiliary industries have also developed in the area surrounding the iron and steel plant. Such industrialization of backward areas has created more employment opportunities for local unemployed persons. The growth of steel industry in India is tremendous and steady, which is supported by many Indian government initiatives and is definitely a boost for the future growth of Indian steel industry.